The most successful seasons in the history of the Towson Tigers basketball still going on. The men play in the NIT tonight, while the women host the NIT game on Friday. Yes. WMAR 2 News' Sean Stepner has more. They're still practicing, still playing in late March. Towson Tigers on three. One, two, three. Towson Tigers. It feels good. I mean, a lot of other teams can't say that they're still playing. We're just fortunate enough to play to prove that we are, you know, as good as we are. The Towson women's basketball team hosts Old Dominion Friday night in the first round of the Women's National Invitation Tournament. It's the program's second trip to the WNIT, the other in 1969. The tournament punctuates an already historic season. Their 24 wins, a new program record. We've accomplished some goals that we set out to meet and it's, it feels really good. It feels good as a coaching staff. It feels good, you know, for the young ladies to be able to experience that and to feel some pride that, you know, we've accomplished so many things. While the Tigers are laser focused on this game Friday night, there is still residual emotion left over from their controversial exit from the conference tournament. Colonial Athletic Association semifinal versus Delaware on Saturday. Tigers up one, called for a questionable foul as the clock ran out. Pulled back off the floor after they thought they had won. Two Blue Hen free throws later, Towson eliminated, losing 56 to 55. The last game we got robbed, in our opinion, and I think that you know being able to play in WNIT and like trying to get that game back is just kind of exciting for us as a team. It was ticky tacky. I mean, did we think we got robbed? Yes, but I mean, I think the main point is to not leave it in anybody's hands. Head coach Diane Richardson wants her team to treat this as the ultimate learning experience. We've got to get past it, and the girls have got to get past it. One of the things I was trying to teach them is that. Life sometimes is not fair. By getting this WNIT bid, it'll help them to move past it even more. Tip time Friday night at CQ Arena, 7 p.m. In Towson, Sean Stepner, WMAR2 News.